Hey friends, it's George Carroll. I'm here with my good friends at Opta, and they have a really important message for you. You can't I'm now to visit with George Carroll, a man who bills himself as the homeless motivational speaker, and talk about his unique journey. George, thank you so much for being in here. Yeah, thanks for having me, Dave. It, it is. Everybody, can we do something cheesy real quick? All right, everybody just grab a partner, grab your partner by the hand, and everybody just connect in the room. Yes. Yes, you have to. Should we pray too? Lord, thank you for this day. As you listen up here, in the day and age that we live in, we have to develop in corporate environments, we have to develop the kind of culture that embodies family, don't we? in order to succeed and just feel. Get a little woo-woo with me for a minute and just feel the energy surging through you all. Don't get too comfortable and here's why. How many remember Blockbuster Video? Oh man, they were the leaders, right, in their industry. They were one of the first larger companies to come out and do rental videos, right? And then what happened? And as a result of the demand for streaming online, and remember Redbox came out, totally changed the industry. They put more locations in more places by putting those kiosks in there. They dropped the charges, and pretty soon, people stopped going to Blockbuster. McDonald's, top three recognized brands in the world, their sales have plummeted over the last few years as a result of them being too comfortable. In fact, they will close this year anywhere from 700 to 900 stores. So comfort, remember this, write it down, remember this somewhere in your universe, that comfort is the enemy of innovation. Right, double clap. Yes. If it's not working, don't fix it. <laughs> My friends, it's George Ira Carroll. I'm here in the heart of uh, the gas lamp in San Diego, and I'm out here doing free hugs for a couple of hours. And so I just wanted to bring you on this journey with me. Doors are open. The world needs more hugs. Get them on their hot. I know, it's free. Limited time, free hugs, man. Limited time. Oh, come on. Are you going to charge me? No, free. All day free. Come on. Take the hug. Take the hug. Take the hug. have heard the little story about the little boy who's on the ocean and he's sitting there and he's throwing starfish back into the ocean right and this old man comes up and he says what are you doing it's like do you see all these starfish it's like you're not going to be able to help all of them and that little boy looks this old man up and down like this he says grabs a starfish throws it back in he says it made a difference for that one Hey friends, it's George Ira Carroll, and I'm here with an amazing group of people called Lawyers with Purpose, and they have a message for you. Your story matters. Now go tell it. Your story has value, doesn't it? Is that your story has impact? Do you recognize that? And do you know that your story is a unique energetic blueprint that nobody else on this planet has. How cool is that? So I'm just a kid, right, from Pueblo, Colorado. As you, from a young age, my passion, my dream, my vision was to play professional football. Now I know you're looking at my massive 5'7 frame <laughs> and thinking, gosh, she really does have the build for it. Uh, 
George joins me in studio today. George, how are you doing today? I'm awesome. Thanks for having me, Kimberly. No problem. I'm really excited to be here because this is like my life's work. Right. It's about helping people overcome the limitations and the fears that we learn along the way right. so that we can step into a greater life for ourselves. Mm -hmm. And the more money I made and the more stuff that I had, it didn't make me happier. Yeah. And so I got to the point where I, like something changed inside of me and I was guided to go on to this spiritual quest or this journey. And so I took eight and a half months and I didn't plan it. It's not like you plan on going home less, right? Um, but I took eight and a half months, I went homeless, ended up being the most transformational time of my life. Amen. Thanks. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Once again, George Carroll.